Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you like my content, please consider hitting the like button. Also, please consider subscribing, as it is very much appreciated. Um, got a bit of a weakness for tins, as you probably know. You see I've got a lot of tins here. But um, my mate Jack, where I go over forging, found me a heap of tins. And this is not all the ones he got. I've got a couple others inside as well. Yeah, just want to say thanks, Jack, for finding these. He, he went for a holiday... Um, driving around a bit into the Downs country here in Australia, in Queensland here, and he um, went to a couple of places and they he got a, a heap of tin, empty tins for really cheap. So, yeah, thanks, mate. He knows I love my tins. Um, these are hard to get for, unless they're at Christmas time or whatever, um... They're quite often very difficult to get or people want a lot of money for them. So, because apparently they're vintage now, which, <laughs> yeah, shits me to tears. But anyway, um, anyway, he got me, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, plus another two I think I've got inside. So, yeah, thanks a lot for this. But I found these ones at the um, $2 shop and they were $2 each. But they're full of biscuits, which... And they're fantastic little um, little ones. These are even harder to find. And they're the perfect size for, um, yeah, just keeping a few rocks in or keeping a little bit of char cloth or punk wood. This is almost the per perfect size for, um, yeah, that sort of thing. Um, yeah, very good size. And I bought four of them. So, yeah. The advantage of these is you get to eat the chocolates, uh, the the the, tin, the butter cookies as well. So yeah, I found um the, he had a few more there, so I'm, I think I'm going to go and buy him out of them. But they're yeah for two dollars a tin, you you can't go wrong. Like I don't mind paying two dollars for them just for the tin, and even if you threw the biscuits away, which I won't. But um yeah. Anyway, so I've got a fair few of them, and yeah, got these because I like storing me remove rocks mainly in them but these are also good for um making char cloth obviously but the i am going over to a smaller tin so i might sacrifice one of them for char cloth and then the rest of them will be for storing stuff in but uh, yeah i just wanted to say obviously yeah i've got a bit of a weakness for tins i love love my old tins and um yeah, it's just um, the buying the vintage um, brass ones and that sort of thing tends to be quite expensive. Um, yeah, I um, I do love them too, but yeah, the snuff tins, tobacco tins, um, that sort of thing. Yeah, yeah, you pay a lot of money for them, but yeah, these old biscuit tins are really good. I especially like them for um, yeah, storing the rocks in too, because I I tend to like that one's got got all my flints. That's me flints, and then I've got uh, others all there, all got different grades of quartzite in them. That there's special grades of quartzite in them, and they're over there. So yeah, but anyway, yeah, I just wanted to show you them, them on there, and yeah, these ones here. Um, I, I nearly fell over when I saw these ones there because um, I haven't been able to get that size tin, which is a bit smaller and more packable because you can throw that in the haversack and that holds a fair bit of um especially the the punk wood you know like that that's a good and you can actually cast cast into that too so yeah and then just whack the lid on it because it doesn't have a seal um plastic seal in it or or anything so yeah they're a good tin you can use them as a char tin too so yeah but anyway that's just a, a few few tins and i wanted to say again thanks a lot jack um that was fantastic find for me yeah because i found a heap of tins at the markets the other day but they wanted ten dollars each for them because they slapped a vintage label on them so yeah i'm not paying ten dollars for a tin like this you know if it was made out of brass or something i would um i probably would pay that sort of money but yeah not not for these sort of ones but anyway yeah thanks for watching